This is December 20th, though. So let's talk about 25 Days of Christmas. We are almost done. Oh. We are almost <laughs> done. <laughs> okay, my little brother's back for this one. Um, yeah, we are almost fun. done, guys. Somebody I'm, sprayed um, me with that spray. Now my leg originally is gone. scheduled. This was originally scheduled to be Toy Story at that time for God. But then at the end of last episode, you could hear us talking about, oh, that's not very 2000s now, is it? So today's episode is you saw the thumbnail and probably read the title and you're like, oh, I know about that. It's Frosty Returns from 1992. That's not 2000s, With but John you know what? John Goodman. <laughs> Wait, we're looking for um, something that came out in the, two, in, in the 2000s. In the... Hey, it's a 2000s nostalgia. <laughs> Late 90s um, counts as 2000s. Alright. All right, I gotta read, I gotta read the description. Hold up. <laughs> okay. The continuation exploits of a fa- the ex- uh, exploits of the famous snow- snowman. He's exploit. <laughs> Let me just let me just restart. Oh my god, I just had a stroke. Okay. The continuing the continuing exploits of the famous snowman as he goes up against a more powerful force which threatens all of Christmas. The special was released released December first, nineteen ninety two. It stars John Goodman as the voice of Frosty, and he's not even credited on IMDb. Why is he not credited on IMDb? That is weird. Spooky. Maybe this was like the one Christmas movie he didn't want to be associated oh, wait, there he is. with. No, he's he's there. It's just like the. Oh like yeah, the this, is, this is the one where the Flying Dutchman plays the bad guy, right? I don't know. I haven't seen this in like a year. I'm just saying, like the voice for Captain Knuckles and the Flying Dutchman is the same as the bad guy in this movie. Yeah, when I fi- when I found out they had the same voice, that just my entire world just like, just it just. This was rocked. Yeah. Uh. Well, you think we need to start watching soon? Because I think I might be melting. Yeah, we, yeah, we gotta record. <laughs> we should <laughs> record this. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. I'm, okay, tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow we're watching All Dogs Christmas Carol. Forgot to say that. Uh. Yeah, we're gonna watch that tonight too. So we gotta. <laughs> these episodes might be a little bit short because. It's the 16th. We're dying. All of it's the 16th. All of the other reindeer is coming out tomorrow. It's still X40. So we gotta. What? All right. So we gotta. Oh, we gotta, get we gotta, we gotta go. I'm melting here. Oh, Lord, he's gonna die. He's already right. dead. We'll see you in a few seconds. Goodbye. And we're back. Hello. Do you want to cross your turn? Yeah. Oh. Ugh. Sorry Ugh. if we sound t- sorry if we sound tired. It's late. I'm not we even are... tired. I sound yeah, tired. Yeah, I had to do late. my uh, Christmas shopping. I had a day, man. I just I found out the Simpsons episode was corrupted, and also that I can't go to college probably until spring because of just. Hey, issues hey, with life in it's general. Be so fine, I, man. I mean, yeah, it took it's me a so while good. to get to college. Like, yeah. it's Dang. gonna be a little awkward, but y- you'll get there. You'll get there. I already went to college, though, but my college was terrible. That's a whole nother. That's a whole nother discussion. I went to okay. <laughs> long story short, went to a college. Went for like like a, like a quarter. Realized that oh my god, this is terrible because none of the teachers helped me. They kicked me out because we didn't pay tuition, even though I wasn't told that I needed to pay the tuition yet because I did FAFSA and that's supposed to pay for that. But <laughs> anyways, <laughs> um, Frosty the Snowman, uh, Frosty returns. You know, be good, huh? I'm in a closet right now. All right, it's uncomfortable. It's that's quite the a good was. Frosty. Nothing the villain was wasn't top the original though. The villain and the wasn't third even a one villain. Is weird. The villain I like isn't even a villain. All he wants to do. Is help people to get away. Just, just the snow that's just blocking that, like, making it really hard to like for their even drive. And it's just, he's the villain. Oh my god! Why I the yeah, but but it's <laughs> but it's aerosol on guys, the environment. Guys, this is December twentieth. 
There's only five okay. left. There's only five <gasps> left. Oh, goodness. No is an act of God. Oh. It can't be oh. stopped. Wait, is there five? We could do that one, that one. I haven't one. even snowed once One, two, I'm three, sad. four, five. Five, yeah, yeah I five haven't one, seen one. snow five. in years. Yeah, we gotta do five. Yeah, yeah, it hasn't snowed yet over here. I asked my Alexa the other day. I was like, hey, Alexa, what's the weather like just to test her volume? She was like, it looks like it's gonna snow. But it didn't. It, it, <laughs> it looks like snows. it. It just to rains it? really hard. Every year. We got White Christmas, I think. Last year, the year before that, I don't know when it was. If, if we did, that was it was the like first time I've ever seen snow. an animal. Ah, uh, snowy Christmas is my dream. Oh, and I don't know if you remember this, but you remember, um, I don't know if you remember it, but we had weather that was like so bad. We just called it, my family calls it the ice weather because it was just so cold. Like it wasn't even snow, it was just pure ice. We could not leave. There was no power for like like a week or two. A Christmas? Like a week and a half, probably. Huh. Around that time, I don't know. It was. Yeah, you were kind of. I think you were like probably like four or five when it happened. You were <laughs> playing Pokemon. We didn't have power for like a month, so like my house I also burned. No, well, no, no, last my house year burned. My, we um, had a my... power meter get ripped from the wall. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This, this, now this is a contest with Pop. My house almost burned down during that time. <laughs> Let me explain. Uh -huh. My mom was burning. <laughs> my mom was burning. Uh, some some bush bush branches. I couldn't think of the name. She was burning some branches out from outside, and she went to grab her crackers that was on the um the 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 sofa. I was at home. She told me about this. And she looked over, and the couch was just melting because it like a cinder <laughs> came out or something. Oh, came out. It was just burning. She threw her drink at it. <laughs> hey, what? what? My entire house could have burned down, Pop. Are you laughing? I was Honey, poor. Why is the couch I, melting I have, again? I have a kind of similar story. <laughs> Say. So you know those like fish tanks with heaters on the bottom, like the big ones. No. Uh, no. I remember yeah. when we had a giant fish tank. Well, yeah, there. we had one, and Finn knocked it over, and it almost burned uh, the entire well. house down. <laughs> so, yeah. Dang. Finn, Finn's our other brother. I mean, the water people. put it, water put it out. Finn's our other brother for people who don't know. No, the, yeah, the, he's the, the, he's that he's that he's, guy from Winter Time. He's your yeah. other other brother. I have so many <laughs> brothers. Um, yeah, you find a new one every week. It's like how I find a new cousin every time I'm with the family. <laughs> Pretty much. Like, oh. will you ever, will you ever meet all of your cousins? You can't. No, because my cousins, my, my cousins keep on breeding, so I keep on having these second and third cousins. <laughs> I'm like, what? The I, I'm having so many cousins that I don't care when there's a new one. I'm just like, okay. Like, yeah, I got this like, one oh cousin who's really good with cars, okay. and I'm telling him about the DeLorean. Ooh. He's like, wait, so what was this DeLorean build like? Oh, it had everything. It had Ford parts, Chevrolet parts, it was a Frankenstein. Flux capacitor. No, no, no not that, custom, that DeLorean. I meant a custom you right, one you right. that someone made. You know DeLoreans are actually awful cars? I still want one, but, you yeah. know. Back have... to the Future was really good marketing for that car. Yep. Um. <laughs> they actually, I think it was the director. Um, he was offered, um, like a, like a couple million dollars if they would make it into like from Toyota if they make it into like a truck or something like that. I forgot what it was. And he said like Doc Brown doesn't drive an effing like whatever truck it was. <laughs> <laughs> it was amazing. I, I am so sick of. I love Back to the Future for people who don't know, and I I know a lot about it. I am so sick of what you never knew about Back to the Future, or Robert Zemeckis telling the story about Back to the Future of how it came out. Because I I always I know the story, and so I'm just hearing him repeat himself every time, just in a different location and different camera quality with these interviews. It's just like he's like, oh, just take it to Disney, take it to Disney, take it to Disney. Every every trivia is just like, did you know that the DeLorean was going to be a fridge? Did you know that Eric Stolten was going to play Marty? Did you know? <laughs> Like, be a fridge? What? Yeah, it was gonna be a fridge, but then they were like, "Oh well, yeah, uh, kids might try and climb in their fridge, so we can't do that." And then so they made the car <laughs> purely. They made the car for the in the, fridge. <laughs> the the one scene where um, Marty goes back in time and he's in the barn. What? When he's in the yeah. barn, uh, wait, well, when when he's in the barn and like, look, it looks like a spaceship. That was that entire joke was why it's the Del it's a DeLorean because of the doors. <laughs> um. <laughs> So, 
how would it be a bad influence on kids for them want to climb in their fridge? Oh, it's a better influence if you will. Oh, I'm going to get in this car and drive 88 miles per hour in a straight line and time and try to time travel and try not to crash my what car. car? Okay, I think more what kids have access to a fridge. Again, the average, average cars can go like 120 miles an hour. Did you say yeah, what kid can drive a fridge? What do you need that? No, no I'm saying what can a kid has access to a car more than they have access to a fridge? Poor kids. True. Wait, yeah, what? yeah, you know, like in every in like every bad neighborhood, there's that oh, one jalopy okay, that the kids play in. It's just old man Jenkins jalopy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, we actually, we actually talk about movie. Car. No, we actually this is us talk. This is us talk about. We talk about the movie for ten percent of the of the thing. Uh, wow. Oh yeah, Frosty was trying to walk into a fridge, but he uh, got a <laughs> cramp and a freezer burn. <laughs> I had to go to the dentist today. It hurt because I had to. I had to put oh, a needle in my like, cheek. I need to oh, go to the dentist, dentist but, still but uh... But we haven't been able to because of the Backstreet Boys World Tour. Yeah, I, um... So, I was listening back on the Alvin and Chipmunks recording of uh, the podcast with the high-pitched voices. I love how... Between me and Pop, you can't really tell who it is. And then it's just Gendy. You can tell because this is just how you talk, Gendy. You can tell it's you and I love that. Yeah, like yeah, I was listening person. to it in the, I was so high to it. in the car with my mom while we were out Christmas shopping. Again, I love really how like, I ever. popped in the scream was like, nah! I love how Gibby is like, our was... gave me a heart attack. I was Gibby. already in panic-inducing woods. I was making my eyes have a seizure because of all the shadows. Gibby? I like I like how I like how you're literally in the podcast yet you're almost dedicated fan that listens to them a moment ago. Well, I mean, somebody's got to. Thank you, Gendy. Gendy, you are like, you are seventy-five percent of our views. Hey, hey, <laughs> that might change. I mean, I still need to link our podcast to uh, some of the other people I know. Just literally link my entire it. channel. Just <laughs> <sighs> they hate us. <laughs> True. Who knows? Maybe maybe you could uh, do a crossover with the sad nostalgia guy. Oh my god! Imagine if we could go on Rebel Taxi's podcast. Oh, that is a dream of mine. Oh my god! I would love to, I would love I'd to meet Pan. To, he seems I'd like such a chill guy. Like saying, "Hey, Pan! I just got cell damage because you told me so much about it. Come on, man! You gotta respect That's good us." Pan. That's a good Pan. Like, come on, dude, I'm anime all over this. What? Oh yeah, oh yeah, Kay, are you gonna are you gonna talk about how the movie was a good hand reference? Oh yeah. It's a good hand reference. <laughs> so, come Frosty's on, hands. Uh, when you draw okay. hands, okay. you literally told me you based them off word girl. Okay. <laughs> no, it didn't. I have, you did it up. I, I have like oh, third I have like twenty five to thirty pictures of Frosty. On my phone now, just while we were watching it, because his ha- because of his hands are just like really great, and like how they wa- I want to draw hands. So that's concerning. Yeah. Okay, let me I, let me count. Let me count. Well, you people come on talking. I'm gonna count. We mean you people. Anyway, uh, was the villain even a villain? He just wanted people to have a convenience. Yeah, but at the sacrifice of the world being messed up and future mm-hmm. generations having to pick up the slack. Because there's a giant hole because of aerosol cans and the environment being screwed beyond repair. You're right. I don't know if my whispering was picking it's up, like but I saw, little, I saw my profile. I saw my like picture pop up. It's like that little, up, so. uh, uh, what's her name from Sweden said. Oh, no, I forgot what number it was. It was over 30. I think it was like 30 something. Hold on. You know, the, the, the little high school girl at the UN meeting. I love how Kit just kept pausing it. It's like, wait, 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 that's a good hand reference. Yeah, no, I lost count. Okay, you know what? It's like, okay, let's just go with 33. 33, let's just go with 33. I like that number. You flip the threes around, you got one big eight. Hey, go. add six more, and you got the uh, the amount of uh, mint chocolate dilly bars at the Dairy Queen. What? 
at the Dairy Queen. They sell those Christmas tree dilly bars. They're mint chocolate, and you can only get them in packs of 38. I mean, 39. Oh, okay. I thought you meant like I thought you just meant how many they had in stock. I was like, why do you know the specific amount that Dairy Queen has in stock? No, no, no. It's like you can buy. It's like you can buy them bulk, and only those ones in bulk for some reason. Dilly bars are all right. We have a Dairy Queen near my house. We're that close. So, no, it was an Arby's. So close. Phil. So Phil, is it? You ever eat a Dilly bar? Them things. They got the chewiest ice cream ever to me. I like the chewiness. Can we, I just want to appreciate Pop real quick. Just what did I do? Like constant, you just constantly update us. You just like that you just add every, you just at everyone in the server and just be like, oh, this episode's up. <laughs> yes. Ah. Because I see them. I see them just uploaded as a good. Oh yeah, the new one's up. Just so you make sure. I heard a noise, and I have my Nerf Rival takedown by my bedside, just so that I don't get disturbed. Wow. I am not afraid to become the End Striker and take you down, beast. Hey. <laughs> I hear the voices thing going of something. Giddy just I gets thought attacked I heard something walking it. around. Something scaring <laughs> me. Someone just gets gets just gets murdered on the voice call. That'd be good content, honestly. Could, could you get murdered real quick? Nah, nah, nah. Then we'd rip off Unis Honest. What's Unis Honest? Oh, I'm sorry. I mean, deleted channel. Ah. Uh, okay. Because they had that video of the guy getting murdered while they were doing some funny thing. Welp. They died. Except he wasn't dead, he came back to life or something. And then there was a creepy clock. <laughs> Who knows? Who knows, is it, man? Is he really dead? Is he really so, there? So, Phil, is it? It wasn't. The meme is so good. Not the first time Dairy Queen has made a good meme. Remember you the give, popcorn shrimp? You you give me fire, I give you rock. It's like, hey honey, what you got there? Popcorn from Dairy Queen, wanna try? Sure, it's good. Hey, wait a second. This isn't popcorn, it's popcorn shrimp! It's two <laughs> shrimps eating it. They're like, oh, I thought it was something familiar about it. Hold on. Where are the kids? Ah! <laughs> just, kill the ch just kill the children. Where are the kids? They were killed. Linda, where are the kids? Empowered. It's like that Simpsons episode. Just Perhaps I dead. should start by eating your shorts. <laughs> Not my shorts. Don't listen to Bart. Uh, Bart Simpson, that's the man I want to grow up to be. Don't be- Hey, Bart's a bad influence. He's an underachiever. Hey. As the Simpsons once said, every family in America is like them. Not really. I'm not Homer, Samson. <laughs> we didn't really have much to say about, about the Frosty, did we? It was just- it was an alright special. Yeah, it was a decent little cartoon that had some good animation. John Goodman was a really writing. flat. Singer. John Goodman was a really flat singer. Yeah, but he he did his best. He was a good. He was an okay Frosty. Hey, he's better than when Patrick's voice actor played Frosty, and there was the third kid. I've never I've never seen that one. Wait, really? I could have sworn Nickelodeon would play it. I don't Cartoon remember Network. It. I don't know. I don't even know anything about it. Yeah, there was like a third Frosty where they had this uh, boy who was afraid of everything and a very, a very overprotective mom who like wanted to stop Frosty. <laughs> she just, <laughs> she's just the villain. The mom's just the bad guy. I don't know. 
something about wanting to, to stop Kelsey. fun or whatever. I've got, I've got to get the hair. I've got to get the hair dryer to protect my son. Frosty. <laughs> Gotta get the hair dryer. Gotta get the hair dryer. What are we using the hair dryer for? Yeah, put it, put it in the so oven. Getting... No melt. So oh, we're killing snowmen. Don't put snow in the oven. That's a bad idea. We're, kill, we're killing snowmen. You, that's your through. favorite thing, Kit. You're killing snowmen. You, you love yeah. that, right? Yeah. What is the best strategy to kill oh, a Kevin. snowman? <sighs> this podcast is giving me t- PTSD with Jack Frost, man. It's... <laughs> oh, so what I was saying is with Pop, can we just appreciate Pop? How he always keeps it updated, like in the chat, like in the chat. You're always like, "Well, this episode's up, that one's up," and then just now you're like texting us, like, "Oh, it's been bad time." Well, yeah, we we, we 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 can see that, we can see that, Pop. Ah. Uh... So, are those two brothers not even talking? <laughs> If they were to make another Home Alone movie, they should have him use one of these Nerf rivals because these yes. things can leave welts on you. Your making brother's a Home Alone series, brother, I'm pretty sure. Your brother hasn't talked since the beginning. Like the, he talked for like the first minute or so, and then just stopped talking um, completely. We would have done recording yesterday, and we were supposed to record no. this one in tomorrow's episode on Dog's Christmas Carol, but. Um, we ended up playing Among Us. Yeah, we um, were all hooked up on that new Among Us we, on the Switch, fam. I thought we were. I thought we were gonna play like a few matches, but we we ended up playing like what, like we played for hours. We basically played all night. Yeah, me, Pop, Gendy, my little brother, my other little brother, and my other little brother. I have so many. Like, might and be your other mother. And then I got. We, and there's then a lot of people. Hold on, let me, count, let me count. Okay, let me count how many people. Kanye West. Yes, yeah, seven. Kanye West isn't yeah. there. Yes, yeah, seven people. Featuring like Dante from the Devil May Cry series. I mean, it's seven oh, yeah, people Kip. playing. We, it we, was amazing. We talked about the um the third Frosty movie where you were gone, by the way. Which one was that? The one that had Patrick's voice actor play Frosty. Oh, Bill, Bill Farkle, Bockle. Like that, that, that sounds amazing. Yeah, he's just like, like I could have sworn I saw it somewhere. I don't remember where. I don't know. I think it was on Ooh. Nick. It might have been Cartoon Network. What do you think? Um, I don't know. I remember, I remember a Frosty special. I don't know which one it is. With the guy who's just like a narrator, right? <laughs> he has like a weirdly detailed face. And like these kids. One of the kids, so you can't see the bottom half of their face because it's covered up by the, the scarf or whatever. He walks up to these kids and just picks one up and just kind of stares at them while he's saying like, Oh, gee, Willikers, sir, we're kind of sad because Frosty's not around, or whatever he said. <laughs> it's why, so, why, why is the narrator... Oh, that's amazing. Why is, the, why is the narrator of this one, why is he like a little, like, like potato man? Yeah. yeah. He's like the a first happy one just, little potato. The, the first one is just this nice guy, and the other one's like, Err... Get in my bag. Pop's not even that short, and I always call him short. Pop, expose yourself. Yeah. How tall are you? Um, um, um. No. <laughs> I don't want to get doxxed. I don't want someone to recognize me by my height. And then you were like, okay, so hey, you're that guy that... from the podcast. Hey, look! It's the idiot from the video! Chesterfield Street. Hey, look, Mom, it's a crazy chicken. I like out. I was trying to say, I was trying to say Pop's location. Did I like out? No, you can't hey. say the location. My social Otherwise, security we're number have to take you out and replace is you with a new kit. Three three four three four four nine nine two four. Eight eight nine nine one. <laughs> That's one, probably one, four, actually nine, someone's seven, social security two, number. Five three. <laughs> I was random number. Like, you probably got like extremely close. You're like, oh my god. You just dox someone. <laughs> <I didn't... laughs> he doesn't have a social security number. You gotta be a person. I have one. But why does this thing have a lock on it? Um, why don't they put a safety lock on a Nerf gun? Who knows? Some Nerf ASMR. 
<sighs> I'm excited for Raw Dogs Christmas Carol. How about you guys? Yeah, I have not seen. I haven't seen that since I was a kid. I watched that more than I watched the actual All Dogs movies. But we'll I watched save the, that. I watched tomorrow. the first. I watched. I watched both. I watched. I had both of the VHS. Shh. We'll save it for tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, should I just spoil what the rest of these are, besides the very last one? You know, you can, you can, you can, you can figure it out if you look at the teaser. But still, I could just spoil. <laughs> Figure out if just post, tells you. I post oh, the man, list on I Twitter, so... <laughs> In the very last episode, I want to do a side-by-side -side of how my list started and how it looks now. Dude, it is just... There's so many holes. It's like... It's like cut up. It has so many marks on it. Oh my Good god. This, this little list. I never... I, I've had this for like over a month now, and so... And it's been folded up and lost it at one point. This thing thing, I'm, I'm holding on to it though. I'm holding on to it forever, just as a reminder to never do the 21 days of Christmas again. Yeah. 31 days of Halloween. 31 days of Halloween. Every time I think Pop, of like, like a pumpkin. I should, oh, I should get a frame at work. I'm gonna get a frame at work now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna <laughs> frame I gotta, it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna frame it as a, and I'm gonna get like, I'm gonna label it underneath, just like a, a constant reminder to never do this again. Hey, hey. A mistake. <laughs> Maybe you could do like uh, the Ed and Nettie thing where you like rip the chimney out, <laughs> put it in his bedroom. Yeah. I am tired. I love this podcast, but I'm so tired of it at the same time. Hey, hey, it's going to be fine. <laughs> I swear to God, if I have to hear that intro one more time. <laughs> I keep on getting copyright claimed for it. Not a strike, but claim because I because I go, make it go on for too long. Because there's a certain point where I like it's like when it, I know a certain point in the song where I gotta cut it, so that's when it fades out. And I keep on putting it at the wrong point, so it just keeps on going. So. Why don't you just, just why don't you just why don't you just download the download the audio and just cut it down and just keep it as that audio so you don't forget? Uh, because it's more work. It's easier just to put it in. And just <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah. Just He's look not committed. At the picture and make it. It's like baking cookies. Oh, dude. dude, okay. What? Come back. What? What was well, I talking about? Oh, <laughs> he just zones out. So. No, no, no. My, my, my mom was asking for my dog to come in. And I was like, no, I have food. I have, I have a burrito, man. My dog's been trying to eat my yeah. burrito. Oh, it's cold down enough to get hit. Did you ever see that old viral oh, oh, video of the dog Ow. swallow the burrito whole? Ow. Ow. Do dog devours a burrito in one second. Kid, are you dying? Yeah, yeah. Is your mouth literally just catching on the fire? How are you going to talk? Good use Morse code. Mm -hmm. um, that reminds me yeah, of, sto no, of a story. Stick your tongue to the roof of your mouth. It works for everything. Sneezes, I was, I, I, colds, headaches, beats I got a story. Yeah, it's story. 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 So, um, when was it? It was when I was in high school, which it wasn't that long ago because I'm only 19. So, it was probably 2018 or 2017, something like that. No, 2018, pretty sure. Whatever, it doesn't matter. Anyways, it was cold in my room. I'm like shivering. I'm like, I'm like dying of pure <laughs> just cold, right? Pure so, cold. I some hot chocolate, right? And I, and it was hot. And I take a drink of it, and you know that feeling you get when you drink something hot, and you like you burn your tongue for a second, and it goes away after a few minutes, you know? Yeah. Yeah, that, that feeling didn't go away for me. It just kept on. It just was a constant. Is it I was still like, there? And it hurt. Like, oh my god, it hurt. Later on, that day, um, we had a bag of Doritos, right? And I get a Dorito. I place it on my tongue. Nothing. <laughs> so. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm just, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, wait a minute, what the heck? So I'm trying to eat another one. I taste nothing. So like, I can taste like a very, very faint. Fa this was two years ago, by the way. So this wasn't, you know, that. So, so yeah. like, I'm just trying to, like, I'm trying to see, I'm like, what the heck? What the heck? <laughs> yeah, I burnt off the taste buds in the middle of my mouth. So, Yikes. That's a lesson Scary. for you. Don't, that's a, that's a lesson. They came back in like, like I got a taste to get back in like a week, but like, that's a lesson for you. Okay. Wait for things to cool down. 
<laughs> also, but it cold. Have you ever had ketchup without taste? It that sounds like terrible. It's like, it's like it has like glue consistency, and it stings you. It stings. It's like it's like a bee. Ketchup without like it, taste. I don't like that. Ketchup without that taste is. sounds like. Ketchup without taste sounds like a like a indie group, like an indie rock band yeah, group. Yeah, yeah, like uh, we should start that. Like they're trying to be the next Lemon Demon. We should, we should, we should, we should start Lemon that. Lemon Demon, they sung the ultimate showdown of Ultimate Destiny, and two oh, trucks. Okay. okay. And Cabinet Man. We and get it, Gindy. Gindy, we get it. Oh, wait, there was an all dogs go to heaven. Good. There was an All Dogs Go to Heaven series, apparently. Yeah, yeah. One of them was, uh... One of them was something about, like, uh... Duh, duh. I forget I'm, what I'm, I was going with. I'm preparing for the next episode, by the way. People who are listening. Yeah. People. Y you, you people. I got it. I'm just preparing because we're probably going to be wrapping this up soon because we got to record this one. We got to record the intro and the outro and the recording for this one. Next one because we got to watch, watch yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, that too. So. Ooh, I can see screenshots and it looks relatively okay. Not going to have Don Bluth animation, but, you know. Hey, it whatever. can't be helped. It can't be helped. I almost. <laughs> Almost started reading off the IMDb thinking this was the can I, say, can I say it this time? Sure. Um. Be Drink. mean. Re uh, um. Don't don't rewind your VHS tapes. Fast forward. Fast forward. Fast forward. Fast forward your VHS tapes. What? You get one it. shot and you blew it. <laughs> Be kind, <laughs> rewind, and we'll see you in the next one. When we watch All Dogs Christmas Carol. Or do we? This just got weird. <laughs>